what is going on people it is your boy daddy mac and welcome back to another pokemon sword and shield wi-fi battle we are against london uh london is bringing a pretty cool team to be 100 percent honest with you and really quick let me just touch bases on this cinderace and magiarna got banned from smogan ou so i know we've already built a team around cinderace and i like doing three battles with the team so since we already built the team and since we started using the team before um well since we started using cinderace before he even got banned we're going to continue to use him at least for these two battles uh, but after that we probably won't be touching cinderace until the crown tundra comes out um speaking of which greninja might make a return in the crown tundra so that's going to be fun too all right so uh what are you going to start with um you're bringing a really fascinating team oh well, i'm fascinated by your team is what i want to say uh, I kind of want to start Cinderace, but I don't think it's optimal for us. Um, it might be, actually. I think I'm going to start Porygon. No, 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 no. I'm just going to do Tangrowth. Yeah, we're going to do Tangrowth first. So start Tangrowth and then go over there. Make sure that Ed, nothing's lagging. Okay, great. All right. Oh, uh, what? No, 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 no. Okay, we might just start with Porygon Z or Cinderace. If, and that's... What am I doing? Oh no, I'm not paying attention. Slowbro starting first, and it's it's a wrap. It's a wrap. I haven't played this game since last Monday, or not Monday, Sunday, Sunday or Saturday, um, because I like to record both. Oh, London, you looking fresh, my guy? You looking absolutely fresh. Uh, but anyways, I like to record both Wi-Fi battles for the week or team builder within the same day, so that's why I haven't played in a while. All right, so Dragapult comes out, and we're starting with Cinderace. I knew it. Okay, this is a problem. This is 100% a problem because... Um, so we're going to go slow, bro, here. We're going to guess that this is a physical Dragapult, and we're going to try to take the hit with slow, bro. So maybe Dragapult uh, or uh, Tangrowth wasn't the best start to go with. Thunder Wave, okay. I wasn't expecting that to be 100% honest, but that's 100% okay. Okay. So now, I'm honestly just going to show him that I have Ice Beam and kind of scare this thing away. Let's see if it works. He's going to get Hex. I'm a Psychic that This is going to do a lot of damage. It knocks me out. Wow. Um, this is what I get. I don't think we're going to come back. Um, I'm going to go Heracross. Yeah, I think this is wrap. We're still going to try. We're still 100% going to try. Both of my stabs are not going to work against this thing, which is the sad part. Um, I, I feel comfortable going Earthquake here. I mean, what do I got to lose going Earthquake? Nothing. It's going to be a, barely a two-hit KO. So he's going to U-turn. That's kind of good news for us. That's kind of good news because he's probably going to go into Corviknight, is my guess. I personally would go for Corviknight. It's a shame I let Slowbro go down. I forgot that sidekicks are weak to ghosts. I mean, why couldn't I get that through my thick skull? Corviknight comes out just like I figured. This thing is a flying type, so we're not about to stay in against a Corviknight. Uh, what's the next best play, though? What's the next best play? Uh, I don't got my wall, so I can't go. <laughs> I really, I, whatever comes in, or what, whatever comes in is going to take some damage against this, uh, this Corviknight. So I'm going to try to go Porygon Z. I have Thunderbolt on, Thunderbolt on this thing. So hopefully I, we can do something. Okay, U-turn. So he's, he's playing with momentum. That's good news for him. So yeah, U-turn on Dragapult and the Corviknight, which is actually really good um, good news to us. Rillaboom is coming out. We're going to get hit by the Grassy Glide. And we're probably going to go down. You know what? We're not going to let that happen. You know why? Unless this thing is a Swords Dance, uh, really boom, then that would be kind of scary. I don't think it is. I'm going to say it's 100% Choice Bandit, and we're going to go into Tangrowth here. We're going to go into Tangrowth. We got the Poison-type attack for this thing in particular. So hopefully we can do something about it. Hopefully. Grassy Glide. I knew it. Okay, perfect. I don't want to overthink things too much. Uh, overthink things. Why did I say thinks? I meant overthink things. Okay, I think that's what I said at least. All right, so I'm gonna sledge bomb here. If you're gonna go Corvid Knight, 100% okay with that, to be honest, because you're probably gonna U-turn again. And like I said, I'm okay with that. Withdrawals, just like I figured. Here comes the Corvid Knight. 
Oh man, he's kind of reading me. He's kind of reading me. I don't want to take a U-turn of the face. I know that for a fact. I know that for a fact. I was tempted to click knockoff and that would have been the better play. But I kind of want to keep Rillaboom locked into the grassy, uh, yeah, the, the grassy glide. And I just come into Tangro for that. I probably sh should have gotten knockoff, actually. So I'm going to go Cinderace so predicting the U-turn here. I thought so. Okay. Okay. That's good. Whatever comes in next, um, I'm probably going to U-turn myself. I don't know yet. I am not sure how I'm going to handle his team. I, I started off really bad is the thing. Crawdon comes out. So I'm suddenly tempted to stay in, to be honest. So we're going to Dynamax. We're going to go for a Max Knuckle. We're at Libero, so this is going to be Stab. And it should knock this thing out unless it's Focus Sashed. Unless it's Focus Sashed, which I hope it's not. I really hope it's not. Alright, so this is the second time we are going to use Gigant Gigantic Max in the race. That cry is beautiful. I love this thing. Okay. I know Aqua Jet. Uh oh. Adaptability is the thing. Wow, that's. Okay, Life Orb. So it's not Focus Sash. This thing's going down. This thing is going down. Uh, I think Dragapult outspeeds us by a, a large margin. We lost this battle, guys. I, I'm 100% sure that we lost this battle. We're, we're not going down without a fight. I'm trying not to be a negative Nazi here, but... Uh, I started this battle off... I, I, I started the team preview off really bad. I mean, what do you expect from me? Oh, by the way, Animal Crossing shirt. I like this shirt a lot. I love it. Okay. What, what are you going to go into next? Rillaboom. I'm not afraid of this thing, if I'm being honest. I'm not really as scared of this thing. I should be. Actually, I am afraid of this thing. I lied. Um, because Grassy Glide is going to knock us out. So maybe the the, um, the bug type move is the better option. Man, we messed it up, didn't we? I don't feel like I want to let Cinderace go down because he just does good against the... Uh... Oh man, that's not good. That is not good. Okay, um, you guys are probably gonna yell at me in the comments, but we're staying in against this. Grassy Glad gonna knock me out, isn't it? Oh no. The play was to go Tangrowth. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Man, I, I just let Cinderace go down. The, see, the thing is I Gigantamaxed and I didn't want to let that go to waste is the thing. We're gonna knock off here. So if you want to switch into Corviknight, feel free to do so. It's going to get knocked off. Oh, man. We lost this. We let our ace Pokemon go down. We let our, our physical wall go down. And we let our ace Pokemon go down. Okay. Weezing is coming in. I'm running. Is this thing Levitate or Misty Surge or what? Okay. So it's, it's uh, Levitate. Okay. No more recovery for you. And, um, I don't want to go into Marowak or... So, Porygon is the next best play. Oh, man. Will-O-Wisp. I, I knew he was going to go for a Will-O-Wisp, hence the Porygon play. Okay. If you switch, um, Analytic, an Analytic is going to come into play here. Okay, so... That's going to kind of uh, neutralize that uh, part of the spectrum there. What do I want to go for? Um, so did I predict uh, Dragapult? I kind of want to, and I want to go for a Shadow Ball, but I don't know if I should. You know what? Just do it. Just do it. That's it. Go Shadow Ball. Switch out. Go Dragapult, my boy. Go Dragapult. Yes! We finally capitalize on something here, which is absolutely great. Okay, so Shadow Ball. Get rid of this dragon pole because it's annoying. Get your babies, get yourself and your and your launch babies out of here. Okay. So we're gonna get some HP, but we're also gonna go back down. I got a mosquito bite on my tattoo, and it looks kind of weird. Can you guys see it? You guys can't see that, but it's like the ink is coming out of my arm. 
that probably sounds gross and i understand why but that's what it feels like or that's what it looks like okay so i'm gonna go tangra up here i think we have to get rid of this rillaboom you're probably gonna go superpower uh why would he go superpower though u-turn oh he's running a u-turn wow that's some damage oh my goodness he caught me off guard with that 100 percent caught me off guard and it's understandable i i personally would not run u-turn on him okay maybe if i wasn't sword dance really boom yeah i would do I, I would um just shut up daddy mac just shut up just shut up you can't even talk okay okay so this is a problem this is a little bit of a problem He's, he has levitate. Don't go earthquake. Part of me wants to let this thing go down. But I don't know if I should. I really don't know if I should. Because what am I going to do against him? Nothing. I mean, we have re we have regenerator. I don't want him to go will o uh, You know what? You know what? I I'm going to predict the attack. So I'm just going to go sludge bomb here. Flamethrower. My boy. We're a salt vest. Take it. Okay, good job, Tangro. Good job. Don't get burned. Good job. Okay. Hopefully, he predicts me staying in, but I'm not. And I'm actually going to take this opportunity. To go Marowak. I'm going to regret this. I already know I am going to regret this. Okay. Okay. Marowak was MVP last week. Okay, good. Okay, good. I obviously can't hit this thing with my stab, which is 100% okay. And that is why I want to hit this thing with the double edge. It's going to hurt. I'm Rockhead. He outspeeds me. No. What? What? I don't got my, my phone for the app. That's a problem. Marowak is just worthless now. Look at that. This thing doesn't have pain. Uh, he might have pain split. I don't know. Man, I messed it up for us, didn't I? Strange stream. Probably going to confuse me with my luck today. Okay, it doesn't. Rock Tomb. Because we want to try at least... We want to try to at least outspeed this thing. Oh, I am playing like garbage today. And the, the worst part is I, I kind of want to do another video. It still lives it, and I'm gonna go down to a strange stream. Okay, so think he has he he resists my fighting stat by times uh, times four here. So no way we're going into that. We're going Porygon Z. We're going Porygon Z. We're going Porygon Z. I'm still close. It's four to three, and I kind of want to try attack. I think try attack. And do I lock myself into try attack? I mean, it doesn't matter because Rillaboom is going to go in here and just uh, wreck havoc with me. Okay. This thing's going down at least. I know that for a fact. Hopefully, I can bring this down to a crit for no reason. I couldn't, You couldn't save that for me on the next move or something like that? Wow. Okay. Um, as I was saying... What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Hopefully, I can bring this back to at least one pokemon one pokemon difference um i really want to predict the u-turn i really want to predict the u-turn so part of me wants to stay in and try attack no that's not the play the play is to go hair across to predict the u-turn and then capitalize on whatever he's gonna bring in Grassy Glide, I resist it. It still does a lot of damage, but I resist it, right? Um, I'm in trouble. I am 100% in trouble. I don't want to go Mega Horn, but I do want to go Close Combat. I'm going to go Close Combat. Please switch out. Okay, nice. Hopefully, it does a lot to the Corviknight. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. This thing, ha this guy haven't, hasn't even used his uh, Dynamax, which is scary. And that's why I feel like I lost. My boy Heracross did a lot of damage. It's a crit. Thank you. 
Thank you for that. I needed that crit. I needed that crit. Okay. We probably won't be able to live an attack from the um, Rillaboom. But I'm 100% okay with it so far. Um, all right. Close combat. And now we're back. We He has two Pokemon. And I'm going to have three after this. Can you knock it out? Yes. Yes. Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh, my goodness gracious. His Rillaboom is going to be a big factor to this battle. And I have a feeling his... Um, his right barrier too. I feel like his this battle is still his though. I brought it back, but this battle is still his. This battle is 100% still his. Rillaboom comes in, which is actually gonna knock me out in one attack. So I'm gonna go Tango Growth. And then, um, what do I do after this? What do I do after this? Grassy Glide. He's gonna lock himself into it. I live 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 it. And that's good news because I'm going to knock this thing off and I'm going to switch out next turn or sludge bomb. Mmm. Tempted. This is really tempting. Um, knock off. Sledge bomb. What do I do? What do I do? Okay. Think, 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 think. Think. Um, yeah, I think we knock off here. I think we knock off right or should we just try to get rid of oh, we're knocking off he's switching out he's not switching out he's dying to maxing that's a problem i mean the good news is that now heracross outspeeds him so a mega horn is going to do some damage i am scared right now i am not going to lie to you he's probably going to max knuckle too if he's running superpower Max Flutter Block, uh, Flutter by. Okay. We're going down. We're going down. And, um, I think Heracross is the play. Or, uh, Porygon Z. Wow. Okay. I'm gonna go Porygon Z. I'm gonna go Porygon Z. This is gonna come down whether or not he's Tim in nature. And I'm gonna Ice Beam here. I'm Specs, hopefully it'll knock him out. Hopefully it'll knock him out. I am really worried right now. He withdraws. Okay. That's funny. That's interesting. Analytic is gonna come into play here because I'm moving second. That's a shiny right here right there. Wow, okay. Ice Beam. Weakness policy. No. Am I gonna bring this back? I outspeed this thing. I don't think he has priority. He lo he won. He won, didn't he? He won. He made the right play by switching his Rillaboom out because now he's banded and that's gonna knock out Porygon. Oh no. Not like this, please. Not like this. Okay. Rillaboom. We brought it back to one Pokemon, but I feel like this is good game right here. This is GG. We brought it back very close to one Pokemon, and I'm 100% proud of us. I'm proud of our team. We're going to go down here. Because Porygon is a little bit of a feral Pokemon. And uh, Heracross is just going to go down to a Grassy Glide. No way we're, we're living a Grassy Glide. If I do and we knock this thing out, I'm going to be 100% impressed. But I don't think that's going to be the case. Please get a low roll. Please be. A, please get a low roll. All right, it's, it's a game. I thought so. I thought so. We brought it back. His Rillaboom is his MVP. But who was the MVP in my team? Let me know in the comment section down below. I need, I'm fixing my sock low key. But... One to zero, and I just started off the battle completely terrible. I'm taking a lead card because you look fresh, London. But thank you guys so much for watching. That was a really good battle. Um, I was really surprised that we brought it back to uh, back close like that. So I'm really proud of us. I, I feel like we could have won if we just started the right Pokemon, or if we just um, I guess what's the, what's the word I'm looking for. Or if we were just prepared, because even from the menu screen, uh, uh, men, 
screen even from the menu screen i started off terrible from from the, the team preview but anyways thank you guys so much for watching make sure you guys leave a like if you enjoyed this battle comment down below on your thoughts about the battle and the mvp most valuable pokemon of each team he got the victory i personally think it's his real boom but let me know who my mvp was and also subscribe to my channel for more pokemon sword and shield wi-fi battles i will see you guys next time thank you guys so much for watching